Hey guys, welcome back. It's the Cardis, and in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the Bicycle Auto Cycle number one playing cards. This is the green and purple. Um, obviously, I normally review decks on their own, but this is basically something you have to buy um, as a tin. It was really, really cheap, so it's worth getting, um, and I'll go over what you get. So first off, you get this really cool cardboard box to display it. Um, you can see it's obviously a metal tin inside. Um, it just has Auto Cycle number one playing cards green and purple it has bicycle playing cards collector's tin two premium decks purple and green on the side it just has collector's tin two premium decks and on the other side it has the exact same on the bottom it has the 2017 and bicycle logo and a copper information and a recycling logo and in the back it shows the back design and then the actual tuck case design there pop the tab this is the box you get, just a, a little box. Um, it's got this really cool bicycle name on it there, um, number 808, and it's um, actually like kind of embossed on, so that's really, really cool. Now you get the decks themselves, you open it up and you get two decks of cards. We'll quickly close that up. Now they've got like a metallic -y ink to them, so as you'll notice if I wave them about, they've got this like kind of reflective um, ink, which is really, really cool. So you've got the purple, and then you've got the green and um, obviously the face is inside of the same it's just the back design so obviously you've got a green and a red I'll show you the red one so there's not much to say about this um, it's pretty cool obviously air cushion finish made in the USA um, and then air cushion finish made in the USA but I'll show you the it's literally the same but this one's in green so on the front it has number 808 and it has bicycle playing cards or a cycle number one this is the purple edition it has air cushion finish made in the USA and on the other side it has the exact same on the bottom it has a barcode and some copper information saying this was produced in 2016 on this deck actually but on the box it said 2017 so there you go um, then it shows the back design there really really cool with a stamp um, or a stamp seal and on the side it has standard um, and retro standard size retro face pop the tab and it's got all the copper information for the bicycle brand Okay, I'll show you some of the cards you get. So first off, this is the back design. has a white border, which to be honest with you was expected, um, and it just looks really quite cool, actually. So see, so yeah, quite a decent back design, as you can see. Really quite nice. Now, some of the cards you get. Now, the faces um, are quite standard. There's nothing too much to go over with those. You know, you, you would have seen them before, so I will show you. Um, I shuffled this pack up beforehand just to see what the handling was 100% like because I only played with it for a little bit. But obviously, it's going to be good anyway because of the uh, air cushion finish. So first off, we'll look at the two Jokers. You get two Jokers and it says Joker Joker. They're just standard. There's literally no difference there from anything else. Um, just says Joker Joker. The Ace of Spades is standard as well. You get a card about the auto cycle um, and what it's about. And then you also get a social media card for bicycle. Now the rest of the cards the whole way through are um, the older style faces. and um, They're quite retro but they're pretty much quite similar to what we used to. There's nothing crazy going on with these. Um, and yeah, that's really it with this. So there's not too much going on. Um, it's an air cushion finish. A really nice stock as well. Um, it handles really well actually. So you'll have no issues with this deck at all. Apart from... Uh, Maybe try and do one of those. Um, so all around, this is a really cool deck of cards. It's worth getting. Um, I'll leave a link in the description below for where you can pick this up. It's really worth it. Um, it's quite cheap for obviously what you get. You get quite a lot for your money. So you get two decks of cards and the collector's tin. So to be honest with you, um, it's definitely worth it. So I'll leave a link in the description below. Make sure you pick this up. Hope you guys have a good day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See you in about six hours with a new video. See you then. Goodbye. <laughs>